Hi you guys, how are you doing? We are in Queenstown and I have never done any sort of travel vlogging, blogging or any of that kind of stuff. So I'm going to try my best to do one on this trip. Hopefully you like it. If it doesn't turn out good, it's going to be a good learning experience for me so that I can learn from it and actually really learn to make good travel vlogs. Basically, for those of you who are not from New Zealand, Queenstown is a tourism capital of New Zealand. It's beautiful. It's actually one of the most beautiful places in New Zealand and hence it attracts a lot of tourists. A trip to Queenstown isn't usually the most affordable. Well, it can be, but if you want to have a decent experience, you know, with all the adventurous stuff and sightseeing and all that kind of stuff thrown in, the cost does start to add up. Due to COVID, the sad reality is, is that the tourism industry took a hit in New Zealand as well as all across the world. And that kind of presented the opportunity for locals in New Zealand from other cities within New Zealand to travel to Queenstown and experience it more often than they usually would. So many reduced flights and accommodation prices meant that a lot of us can take the opportunity to travel and experience what Queenstown has to offer. We took the opportunity like most New Zealanders are doing so at the moment. We are at our accommodation, we are in our room. It's not really a fancy place to to stay but it was affordable even the car that we got <laughs> we waited for so long to get it and it's just this really run down car but it, again it was affordable and we can manage it within our budget so that's cool i'm gonna try my best to vlog as many things as i can that we get up to within reason grabbing the camera when i'm doing something i'm trying to find the balance between capturing what I do, more of what I do, but also experiencing things in person seems to be a fine balance. So I'll try my best to cover as much as I can within reason. First thing we're going to be doing is going to Onsen Hot Pools. They are these beautiful hot pools located. You'll see. You'll see what they are. <laughs> I won't try and explain it. Might be easier if you just see it. We're going to Onsen Pool first. The famous hot pools that everybody takes those Instagram photos, and we're finally <laughs> going there. Not sure if we'll end up with much photos because we probably end up just enjoying and forgetting to take photos. Here we go. Here you go, Hanson. That view. Look at that view. Oh my god. Do we have to climb up yeah, these? Yeah, yeah. Oh god. So we get to relax for an hour and then, and then we have to walk up here. Yeah. Walk up huffing Possibly and in the heat. Oh. Oh well, it'll be an experience. This is the experience that nobody talks about. Yep, nobody talks about the uphill walk. <laughs> oh my god, your video. <laughs> yeah. This is <laughs> the part that nobody talks about, the uphill walk. Back. Back from the relaxing pools. God, we're here, you guys. Wow, we check this out. Look at that view. Yay, our little snack and drink pack. So good. I just can't get over this view. It's stunning.
So we're finally in the pool and try to get some photos, but I think you just can't help but put everything down and relax. You know, unwind. Relaxing is pretty hard for me. It's something that I've recently tried to learn, be okay with, and truly embrace relaxing. And been doing some contemplation in the pool. I guess everybody does some contemplation on the pool. Um, reflecting on stuff. Hello. Hi. Relaxing does not come easy. So learning to relax has been a steep learning curve. And to some of you, that might sound bizarre. And honestly, it is very bizarre that I struggle to relax. But in the last month or so, so you're spraying water all over me. <laughs> That's ice water. After being in the hot tub for half hour, it gets really warm. So then now he's put the cold water and it's freezing cold water. Anyway, like I said, it's very hard for me to relax. It's only been a recent thing I've been trying to learn and accept and okay with. Little things like getting ready early enough in the morning and having 15 minutes of silence just sitting down and doing absolutely nothing with a cup of coffee and that person is always like go 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 and I want to relax I, le I want to learn to relax and do absolutely nothing and that's what I've been trying to do recently and so this onsen pool oh, it's actually really nice just sitting here doing nothing except I'm vlogging but besides vlogging I'm not really, really doing much I'm not not really up to much at all. Hi! <laughs> Basically the results of contemplating today in this hot tub, the wisdom of the hot tub is what we're gonna call this. It's time to slow down, we're gonna focus on music, we're gonna focus on growing YouTube, working hard at my full-time job which allows me to have all these nice things in life being disciplined to allocate time accordingly to different things and sticking to it rather than getting distracted by all this other stuff while at work and then when I'm not at work I'm getting distracted by what's happening at work so it's a hot mess and it's nice to think about it and try and sort it out anyway that's enough wisdom from the hot tub Hi. and we're back to the room we had pizza for dinner, so it didn't really get that on camera. We had pizza for dinner, and now we're back in the room. I've got some leftover work to do from my, you know, daytime job that I should have finished on Friday, but I didn't get to. So I'm gonna try and finish all of it tonight, so I don't have to worry about it throughout the holiday. It's kind of the end of today, which is good. It's nice and relaxed and not too jam-packed. This is good kind of the end of the day and so I don't think I'll do any more vlogging after this so after finishing my drink I'm just gonna start working and work till bedtime and go to bed and start day two of the vacation a holiday or whatever you call it anyway hope you enjoyed watching the vlog I'm not sure how entertaining or useful it was but yeah let me know your thoughts and let me know how I can make you better and and with your feedback I can try and make the content a bit more better in terms of quality and content. Have a great day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!